Hi everybody. This is a short video I'm doing for you guys. I'm trying to give you guys some advice. Please don't, don't forget to subscribe. What you're looking at is my regulator. The name is Make Sky Blue. It's a really nice regulator. Okay. Let me take the plastic off. Usually I keep the plastic on. I can remove it now. Okay. This is Wi-Fi Make Sky Blue. You guys, that's the new one. Right now, I am not charging anything. Okay, it, it, this thing works with with Bluetooth. I'm gonna show you how it works. Okay, guys, this is Mix Sky Blue. I think this is 60 amp. In other words, it, it tells you this thing can produce 60 amp. If you, if the panel, the array, how you get your panels situated. It can put you 60 amp. My experience, I have seen it reach 45. I have eight panels, I plug them all. One, one day there was a the sky, the sky was blue. There is no, no problem. So I saw 48, 44. I saw that. I used to have a, a 12 gauge wire. One time I come in, I check the wires, it was warm, it was warm. So this is 10 gauge wire. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna change it to eight gauge wire. This one is eight gauge, okay? I'm giving you tell you a description of this inverter, uh, this regulator, or the or charger controller, whichever name you give it on. Let me turn my, my I can't turn this thing off. Um, this is what makes the noise. It's a, it's an inverter that I have from me, from this company. I forgot the name of it. Um, uh, Power Jack. That's what making all that noise. Sorry about the noise, guys. This is about this inverter, this regulator. Now I will talk to you about it a little bit. According to the paperwork, the 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 the, the sheets they send the, uh, of it. This thing can produce 60 amp. I'm not sure of that. I don't see how you can put the 60 amp. So I don't see it. I because you need a you need a, an amount of panels to put on the thing to produce that kind of amperage. I have eight panels. I'll show you guys in a few seconds. Eight panels. When I have it, the way I have it. Okay. And this inverter. This regulator, you cannot put too many panels on it. They said you can put three panels in, in series. I tried. It didn't work. They said a bunch of stuff. I have a video on that. Check out my video on Make Sky Blue. This thing cannot produce the panels. I, had, I did the test multiple times. Did not produce. Did not produce it. Okay. Now, what's the problem now? So it's an update I'm doing for you guys. It works. It does work. I think this is one of the best regulators they have out there. It has one little problem. Folks, you see the problem? Look at the wire. It burned. Two days ago, it wasn't burned like that. It was, it was a little bit burned. Now, it's this worse. Why is it burned? If this thing's shaking, Okay, because it's hard, it's very hard to tight this thing on. Very hard to tight it. So every now and then, you see where my tablet is? Every now and then with my tablet, I go in here, I put it right there. Okay, I put it right there. You shake the wires, the wire become loose. If the wire is loose, you're gonna have that problem. You cannot have loose wire, you gotta make sure it's very tight. It's very hard to make it tight. Very hard. That's the flaw they have in this machine. I have a lot of them. I have at least five of those guys. They all tend to be this way. They all of them tend to be this way. This morning I came to the garage and check out the garage. This is what I saw there. This is what I saw. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to clean it up, use the other one, and make sure it's very tight. Hopefully, I turn the power on. But because it's Bluetooth, I was able to shut it off right here. 
You see how it's Bluetooth. I shut it off. I can turn it back on. See now it's turned on. You see now I'm producing air village. Okay? Am I? Yeah. This this is building up. I don't have that much sun outside. Earlier this thing was in the rain. This number was right here. It was so uh, so much power. I was producing 1300, 1300 watts. Yes. <laughs> This thing was producing 1300 watts. So I had to turn it off because this was heat up. It was warm. But about the on, it's about five o'clock. Earlier, it's about 525. Earlier about two o'clock, I was here. I had to shut it off. Well, you know, when you got Bluetooth, you can shut it off, turn it back on. You see, let me show you guys. Turn it off. It's off, you see? The voltage drop. Turn it back on. One touch. If you get any mixed car blue, please get the Bluetooth one. Make your life a lot easier. Okay? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pause this video, remove the wire, plug it in, put it on the other holes, because it gives you two two positive wires. It's still running. Oh let me give you the story about this machine. One time I plug this wire in the the black wire in there i plug the positive and the negative the same hole because each hole has two wires you see pv1 pv plus you got the two wires you can put in there you got the pv pv negative got two wires also i was i made a mistake put both of them in there this machine did not blow did not curl off it just don't put this power after one day, I noticed my battery is not being charged. I checked. I couldn't figure it out. I checked the wires. When I came back here, I saw I had both of them on the same. The positive, both wires was on the same. The only flaw this machine has, this thing, turns to burn if the wire is loose. I think the manufacturer needs to fix that. I'm telling you, I have a lot of them have the same problem. You see this? It is it's actually working. So you go to my Bluetooth. I'm producing one amp. There's no sun out there. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna show you the panel. There's no sun. So right now, I'm about to turn it off. Remove this wire. Clean it up. Put it in the other hole and tie it up. Hopefully, this thing is the both of them start up very good. Guys, let me let me pause this video for two seconds. Okay, folks. I cut the wire off. Maybe I'm gonna clean it up. Because I gotta remove it, put it on the wall right there. So I cut the wire off. And I need to clean this thing a little bit. I have to unplug it, take it out. But right now I need to get some charge. I'm just doing this thing for the video. I will remove this. I will not leave it the way it is. I will remove it. But I'll just do it now. I wanna clean the hole. I'm gonna do this thing later guys. Right now, let me show you something. You see a lot of people make that error. You see the you see the hole? A lot of people goes in there to stick this thing in there. That's not how it works. You gotta you gotta open the hole. Okay? Open it. You see? You see the things drop? It's dropped completely. That's how you gotta open it first. Now I'm gonna stick this thing in there. You may do some spark guys. Oh, the other one just disconnect. La la. You see the thing was loose. The other one just disconnect. So. Now I got to tie up the other one. Let me pause this thing and tie up the other one guys. Okay guys, I fixed the wire. This one. That's the negative one. I fixed it. Okay. Remember I cut this one. And I'm about to take this thing off. So now my light turned off. So I'm about to put the other wire in. This is the other wire. That's a positive one. I know it's positive, so this remote control is off. So I'm gonna do I got the you can do a little spark, so I'm gonna use my my homes. Uh, I have something for the homes, the resistance to make it go. Okay, so I'm gonna clean this thing up and plug it in, guys. Okay, guys, this thing turned on, it is working. 
and the budget is at 53 okay yeah I turned it off earlier today because this thing was too hot so I'm gonna clean it off yes I'm gonna clean it off that's why I do it late at night so later on tonight I'm gonna come back here because I won't have no power going to it I'm gonna put it on the wall okay guys my body is at the one thing I noticed Okay, it's giving me the wrong voltage. See, every time you touch the wire, you gotta be careful. Okay, guys, you see how it is. Now I'm getting 40 watts. So you give me a difference, 52. This is a 53. I think it's getting the battery wrong. I don't know. Damn, I had it gone. I thought I turned it off. You see, I forgot to turn it off before. Right well, now I have no sun, so this thing was a problem, so I fix it now. You see how tight it is, guys? It is very tight. You see how it is? But I do have something else, uh, which I purchased, where you can plug two wires from there. I have it. Like I said, this is temporary stuff for the time being. That's why I have it laid down like this. Temporary, even though I'm using it. Because I'm going to replace those, those cables, those wires. This morning it was warm. It was. The cable was warm. Very warm. This is fine. This, uh, it was warm because it was, this one was warm this morning because it was burning. So now I got to clean this hole. Hopefully I can fix that. In the meantime, folks. Now this is a fix. Make sky blue. If you have this kind of inverter. There's a special plug, this, this cell. Uh, I think I bought mine, I don't know where I put it. I must have it somewhere in there. If I have another update, I'll show you guys. Because I may, get the, I may have an update for you guys when I put this thing on top of here. And you will see how well it's well secured and everything. So for the time being, this is what we got here, guys. Okay, folks, until then, see you soon, guys. Oh, just, don't forget to subscribe, it helped my channel. This is Miss Cabo, it's charging all those batteries. Okay guys?